Well, it is National Endangered Species Day. And Louie and Oliver have a couple of them this week. Let's check them out in this week's edition of the News Hounds. Here's the News Hounds, Louie and Oliver, with their World News Roundup. This week on the News Hounds, Puppy Prom is back. A baby gets a new name. And a swim lesson from Mom. But first, Prague Zoo has introduced a pair of critically endangered Chinese pangolins to the public. It's only the second animal park on the European continent to have the animals. The male and female came from the Taipei Zoo in Taiwan. That's the leading breeder of the mammals that are hunted heavily for their scales and meat. But these two are safe and sound. An adorable new baby orangutan at the Oregon Zoo has been named after Dolly Parton's hit song, Jolene. The lyrics of the song describe a woman with flaming locks of auburn hair. Well, according to the zoo, Jolene, the orangutan, earned the name just for that reason, her auburn-colored hair. Jolene was born on April 13th, and her first-time mom, 20-year-old Kitra, is a critically endangered Bornean orangutan. The zoo says Kitra has been taking good care of her baby girl and seems to be taking to motherhood quite well. Jolene's father is Bob, who was moved to the zoo in 2014. We have a pup date from the Milwaukee County Zoo. The new otter pups are now navigating the outside habitat with a little help from mom. Shamrock has been guiding her pups one at a time through different areas of the habitat and giving the little ones their first swim lessons. The zoo says Cedric, Corky, Bailey, and Evie are all doing great. These are the first surviving river otters born at the Milwaukee Zoo. And finally, it's prom season. Puppy prom, that is. After a two-year hiatus due to the pandemic, the Helen Woodward Animal Center's Puppy Prom is back. It's the eighth annual Puppy Prom. It took place in San Diego with puppies who used to be at the center returning alongside other rescue dogs. At the event, the puppies' owners had fun creating corsages and boutonnieres for their furry friends, which is perfect for the mandatory prom photo booth. Attendees were dressed to impress, fine for the chance to be named prom king and queen. But really, in the end, everyone's a winner here. And that's this week's edition of the News Hounds Now Update. The Puppy Prom. <laughs> I love it. Have a great weekend, everybody. Thanks for watching.